Welcome back. All right, so last week I got the opportunity to sit down with coaching legend Bobby Bowden about his film that premiered last night. Well, we, of course, could not miss the opportunity to talk to him about the cham uh, championship game tonight. So let's hear his thoughts. Well, Coach, we got to ask you about the big game. First of all, I asked you, are you going to be there? Where are you going to be watching the game from, Coach? Well, I'll be uh, uh, watching at home on okay. television, see? <laughs> the refrigerator ain't about 10 feet away there. <laughs> I love it. Who are you rooting for, Coach? Uh, well, I'm, that's one thing about it. When you're not coaching, you really don't have to worry about it. But, uh, I, you know, I'm a big Alabama fan. I, I always know, have been. I but know. also a Dabo Sweeney film. Dabo started off under my son Tommy, you know, at Alabama, and then Tommy hired him at uh, uh, Clemson and then recommended him as head coach. So I'm really proud of him. Uh, if you if you pull for the underdog, you'd pull for Clemson. I know, right? Well, and I was letting you know, we were talking earlier, I saw an article written by ESPN comparing you, kind of saying or, uh, Dabo's kind of the today's generation yeah. of Bobby Bowden. Yeah, I heard, the, I heard the same thing, and they called me and asked, asked me about that. I told them I was flattered that they would say that. Yeah. And, of course, he said the same thing. So uh, I am so glad to see him succeed. I, I'm not sure if he's going to get by Alabama. Mm -hmm. I don't know if anybody can beat Alabama, but they might. Okay. If, if, if Clemson's quarterback can play the best he can and Alabama plays like he did last week, Clemson could win that dad young ball game. All right. Talk about Tampa real quickly, too. Uh, this is a big deal for the Bay Area to have this national championship game here. Tampa played a big part in kind of FSU and the team. There's a lot of interaction between Tallahassee and Tampa. Talk about this location. This has been good to Florida State. Well, it really has. We've had quite a few good athletes from down here, and uh, Jimbo is still recruiting some good players out of here. And uh, it's, uh, it's just really St. Pete, Tampa is really a great area to live in, you know. Now, we like Tallahassee. Mm -hmm. If you like the countryside, you go up to Tallahassee, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. But uh, this is a wonderful area down here. All right. So are you calling or Alabama? Is that what we're thinking? Uh, if I had to, you know, if I had to uh, vote on who's going to win, I'd, I'd have to say Alabama, you know. Okay. And, but it, it, I won't be surprised one bit. See, here's where it throws you off. Now, I think if you ask anybody who you pick, and I pick Alabama. Okay. But you go back to the Clemson's game. They killed, they killed Florida. Ohio State. <laughs> no, nobody does that to Ohio State. I know. You know, we played them three times at Florida State, and and I've watched them all my life, and nobody pushes them around. But Clemson pushed them around, beat them thirty to nothing. If now the question is, is Clemson that good? Or do they just have a terrible game? Yeah. If you knew the answer to that, you kind of know which way to go. It's going to be a good game, though, right? I, mean, I think so. Absolutely. It was a great game last year. Yep. And I hope it I hope it picks up where it left off. All right. Well, you enjoy watching it, Coach. Thank you so much. I'll, I'll sure do that. <laughs>